Hello everyone, you are most welcome again on my channel and today we are going to talk about Ben Johnson's and Ben Johnson and in previous video I also talked about Ben Johnson's life and some works so you can check out those videos. We are doing history of English literature series and this is the uh, 20th video. So let's start today's video. If you have not checked those videos so you can uh, check out and you can make your own notes with the help of my notes. So here, first work by Ben Johnson is the important work, Everyman Out of His Humor, you can see. So this work is about humor. He explained the term humor in this work. In Walpoon, and the subtitle is Sly Fox, the entire action takes place in single day. Next, third thing, third uh, right, uh, work is Cynthia's Reveals on Gallantry and Evils of Court. Now let's talk about Walpone. Walpone or uh, Sly Fox. It is a biting satire on absurdities of which human nature is capable. Bartholomew Fear is the work and it is about the or you can call it a satire. It is a satire on Puritanism. Now the Alchemist. Alchemist you can see Alchemist is satire on alchemy. And uh, the next thing is Puritanism. So you, it can be asked uh, in question that which satire is wrote on alchemy. So alchemist and which is uh, on Puritanism. So Bartholomew Fair. So these short notes will help you to identify the right answer. So go through these uh, one and you can learn them. I admire him, but I love Shakespeare. Uh, this quotation is by Dryden and he wrote this in his essay on dramatic poesy. Shakespeare is romantic and Ben is classist. What does it mean? Romantic is opposite to classist and classist is opposite to romantics. So what? who are romantics? Romantics are those who uh, follow their hearts for um, you know writing their uh, writing pieces. It can be drama, it can be poetry or anything else. Who are classist? So classist are those who follow a lot of rules and uh, you can say they are ancients. So Shakespeare is romantic and he does experiment. You can see you, whenever you will read Shakespeare, you will feel that he does experiment with work. And Ben is classist. He is rule bombed. So Ben is a moralist and social reformer first and then he is an artist. But Shakespeare is a dramatist and uh, you can say he is dramatist first. So these are notes for uh, Ben Johnson's. Let's talk about some more writers. So John Webster is important uh, another dramatist. His important works are The Devil, The White Devil, which got published in between 1609 to 12, and The Duchess of Malfi. Both are great tragedies in English literature. Next is Francis uh, Beaumont and John Fletcher. They wrote all the works in collaborations. And the first one is A King and No King, which got published in 1611. The Night of the Burning Pestle. This is another important work, 1607. And The Scornful Lady, which got published between 1613 to 16, and The Maid's Tragedy, and the last one is Philaster, 1611. So you need to study John Webster, Francis Beaumont, and Fletcher after Ben Johnson, or you can say after Shakespeare. These are important dramatists to, uh, to study in uh, development of drama if you are going through. Next is George Chapin. George Chapin, the blind uh, beggar of Alexandria. Next is Pizit Amboise. Carlos uh, Duke Byron. Carlos Duke Byron. And the tragedy of Shabbat, All Fool's Day and at Eastward Ho. These uh, two are his comedies, best comedies. So these are the writers you should study after Shakespeare and in the development of drama. Hopefully you like the video. If you like the video, please thumbs up the, uh, give a thumbs up and share this video with others. Thank you for watching. See you in next video.